Imagine a woman so toxic, people literally died just by touching her. Before you scroll, hit subscribe for more real-life mysteries that still have no answers. On the night of February 19, 1994, paramedics rushed a 31-year-old woman named Gloria Ramirez into Riverside General Hospital in California. She was barely conscious, struggling to breathe, her heart racing uncontrollably. Doctors tried to stabilize her, giving her oxygen, sedatives, and electric shocks to restart her heart. But then, something strange happened. A sharp, chemical-like odor began filling the room. Some said it smelled like ammonia, others like garlic and metallic fumes. When nurses drew her blood, they noticed oily, crystal-like particles floating inside the syringe. Within minutes, one nurse collapsed. Another couldn't stop vomiting. A doctor fainted. The ER descended into chaos. Over 20 staff members became sick and the hospital had to be evacuated. Despite their efforts, Gloria Ramirez was pronounced dead that same night. But here's where the mystery deepens. No one could explain why. Some experts believed her body emitted toxic gases due to a rare chemical reaction with a pain medication she used. Others claimed it was mass hysteria, a psychological reaction spreading among staff. Yet traces of dimethyl sulfone, a compound used in degreasers and jet fuel, were later found in her system, raising even more questions. To this day, the true cause remains unsolved, making Gloria Ramirez forever known as the toxic woman. What do you think really happened that night? Comment your theory below, and don't forget to follow for more stories science still can't explain.